tree, a particle moves along a straight line and passes through a fixed point O. Its acceleration A is given by, so this one is the equation, where T is the time in second after passing point O. Okay, find the instantaneous acceleration of the particle when T is equal to 4. So here we know that A is equal to 8 minus 40. So in A is given that T is equal to 4. So when we know the value of T, we can get the instantaneous value of A. So A is equal to 8 minus 4. So T is 4. So 8 minus 16. So here we get negative 8. This one is in meter per second square. Okay, acceleration does mean it's getting slower. Negative mean deceleration and it's getting slower. Alright. B. Calculate the time in second when the velocity of the particle is maximum. Okay. So, we see here, when we have the, ve the velocity time graph, so you see here, if you have a graph something like this, so we know that here, getting faster, A is larger than 0. Getting smaller, A is smaller than 0. But there must be a peak point before from larger getting to smaller. So at the peak point, A is equal to 0. So here, velocity is maximum, then A is equal to 0. And then for B, when A is equal to 0, so we have 8 minus 40 is equal to 0. 40 is equal to 8, then T is equal to 8 over 4, which is equal to 2. So we can see that T is equal to 2 second when velocity of particle is Maximum. Alright. C. Determine the range of time in second when the velocity of the particle is increasing. So we see here velocity is increasing. You see here velocity is increasing. That means A. So you see A is larger than 0 when velocity is increasing. This one A is larger than 0. So here we say a is equal to 8 minus 40. When A is larger than 0, that means 8 minus 40 is larger than 0. Okay. So here you must be very careful with the negative of the uh, this one variable. So we see here, this one, negative 40 is at the larger side. You see here, when you want to move it, 40. So 40 will be here, this one, 8. You can see, from the larger side, to the smaller side or 40 is smaller than 8 so t is smaller than 8 divided by 4 so t is smaller than 2 so we see here the range of time so range of time when velocity is increasing is t is smaller than 2 